Good morning. It's Friday, October 4th, and here's what people are talking about. House Speaker John Boehner is on the hot seat this morning on the fourth day of government shutdown. The president, who canceled his trip to Asia this weekend in wake of the debate, said yesterday that the, quote, only reason the shutdown continues is because Boehner is bowing to far-right wingers in his party. Legislators return to the Hill today to continue budget talks, where Boehner faces mounting pressure from both sides of the aisle to resolve the issue. And the female suspect in yesterday's Capitol Hill shooting was reportedly suffering from postpartum depression. Miriam Carey's mother told news outlets that her daughter had suffered with the disease since giving birth to her daughter last August. Carey's mother said her daughter had no history of violence and was supposed to be at a doctor's appointment in Connecticut yesterday. And finally, Twitter stocks could hit Wall Street soon. The microblogging site took the first steps yesterday in making its fiercely guarded finances public. The company could reportedly make an offer by Thanksgiving, but if the government shutdown continues, an offer could be delayed until next year. I'm Allie Watkins from McClatchy, and now you know.